welcome to vlogmas day five how y'all doing y'all all right i'm pretty good y'all the noise in the background vlogmas day four going up right now today is december 4th so as i mentioned in that vlog my laptop has been causing me stress she's my enemy at this point i cleared everything off the laptop okay it works when it wants to like i don't understand like i have to shut it down for a little while for it to realize hey there's nothing on here let me like cooperate so this morning before work i got most of the vlog done and i just finished the rest i'm on my lunch break it is 1 30 i have 30 minutes left on my lunch break i'm gonna do some quick makeup because i have a call at two o'clock yes your girl is working today so in today's vlog what are we doing i need to work and talk so i just washed my face I want some moisturizer probably won't see y'all again until after work i have a pilates class after work at 6 30 and then after that we're gonna go look for some christmas decorations because i haven't put up anything yet like the room is bare it's not saying christmas in here at all and i need to get in the christmas spirit because i'm not gonna lie y'all my laptop is stressing me out it's affecting my mood i'm trying to be in a good mood but i can't i just want to be able to vlog and edit without any issues so this is pretty much going to be like a concealer only and brows type of a deal i just want to look put together for my call so i'm not going to do anything crazy it's not necessary I even reached out to Deja and I was like, if my laptop keeps giving me problems, I'm going to have to use yours to get through Vlogmas. Like, I need help. This is not the season for my laptop to be acting like this. It's like very rude. Let's get these brows together real quick. I scratched myself, so that's going to leave like a welt. I don't know what I was doing. Y'all see that? Rough house. Maybe tomorrow on lunch we'll go get my lip wax because... I'm so excited to go to Pilates tonight. I haven't been in a week. I like to go to Pilates twice a week and I didn't go at all last week. So I'm ready to get back into it. After Pilates, if we go get ornaments and stuff, maybe I'll go cancel the gym. Give me the strength. I figure if I go later at night, maybe it won't be like, maybe they won't give me a hard time. You know they don't make it to where you can cancel online or through the app or anything. You have to go in person. Like you have to look them in the face. It's not about like not wanting to go to the gym. I just have everything I need. My husband got me this weight set and between that weight set and Pilates and my walking pad, that's kind of all I need. As far as my fitness goals are concerned, I really don't need the gym if I have all those other things because these weights go up to 70 pounds and then I have some other weights here that I already had. So that's good enough for me right no, I just like low impact home workout type stuff anyway. When I would go to the gym, y'all know I, with my anxiety, I would get super overwhelmed and stuff. It just wasn't a good environment for me and I'm just going to go ahead and cancel it. Pilates is just so, so much of a better environment. It's positive. There's only 12 people in the class. Like everybody's supportive. It's fun. I just, my body loves it. I don't have any need for the gym and if I do, then I'll get a membership again. Right now, I'm not going. It's taking my money. Yes, it is Planet Fitness and it's only $10 a month, but... That $10 can be for me. What can I do with $10 a month? I don't know. It'll make my Pilates membership $10 less, technically. Not really, but you know what I mean, like girl math, you know? I'm saving $10, so in my head, my Pilates class, my monthly membership is $10 cheaper. I'm saving $10 if I go cancel the gym. Balance. So I don't like wearing a lot of makeup when I go to Pilates because I sweat. I'm a sweater. I always be looking around at everybody else. I'm like, why am I the sweatiest person in here? Like, y'all ain't working? I'm tired. It's hot. Well, it's not hot, but it's like, I'm, I'll be struggling. Everybody else be looking cool, kind of collected. I'll be sweating. I'm also trying to figure out what I'm going to do with my hair. I'm going to have some day three hair, you know? This is the day. This is the good day. The best day. Maybe I'll just wear my hair out and put like a headband on. Hopefully that'll preserve it. You know, while I talk trash about this brow gel, this persona, I find myself grabbing it quite a bit. It's not that bad. Would I buy it? No. I just really need to start using the makeup that I have before. I mean, I'm sure a lot of it is already expired, but before it gets even more expired and before I buy more stuff while I continue to still buy makeup. But it's different kind of stuff though. You know, it's not the same. I was also starting to watch this documentary on Netflix called Bat Surgeon. It's not really giving it to me. Ever since I watched the Mother God Love Has One documentary on HBO Max, I highly recommend y'all watch that. That is one of the craziest documentaries I've ever seen. And also the Twin Flames one, which I believe is on Hulu. It's somewhere, but I've been really into like culty type documentaries and I found a perfect TikTok that gave me like 25 to watch. So as far as Mondays go, work is slow, which I'm really appreciative for. Quiet, you know, around the holidays when people start winding down. So I'm grateful for that. It gives me time to catch up on my training that I assigned myself and I didn't do earlier in the year. I assigned myself some um, tech courses. I'm really trying to get into more of the technology side of my job. So I'll probably take one of those courses tomorrow. I'm not, I know I'm not gonna do it today because I'm, I'm overwhelmed. 
from getting this vlog up like I'm my nerves are shot it's just like when things don't go your way especially when you're trying to get a video up at a certain time you're trying to meet a deadline and just things aren't working it's really stressful because you don't know if it's ever gonna work I didn't know last night if my laptop was gonna be working when I got up this morning I'm so grateful that it was and it's been performing as normal as of now but I'm just kind of like stressed out so that's why I'm also really looking forward to Pilates like I want to sweat I want to like release I'm still in my pajamas but I'm gonna put on a shirt in a second just a shirt <laughs> business up top you know how much time do I have all right I still have 20 minutes and this makeup look is already almost done this brush is too small to be doing this I'm also gonna look into some promotion for my channel my views are struggling right now and I need to look at some tips and tricks to help me out with my views it's just not given right now and especially as much work as this is I want the people to see. I need to get it out to the people. I love vlogging. I love posting videos. And I just want everybody else to see. I want to be seen. Okay, she's quieting down. That means it might be done. Y'all hear that? No noise. No laptop. That's good. All right, I'm just going to take some Laura Mercier, some loose powder. Dang it, I forgot to grab that Charlotte Tilbury, that pressed powder again like I did yesterday. Uh-oh. That's the 15 minute warning. See, we look better already. It's just the little things. You don't need much, you know, you really don't. Some mascara. This is the Maybelline Sky High. My favorite Maybelline mascara is still the Telescopic. The Sky High, I know it was trending on TikTok, but it's really not as good as the Telescopic in my opinion. On these sparse lashes. <laughs> Let's go for like a pinky blush today. This is the Sephora Flirt It Up. It's like this, very pretty. I'm gonna wear the same lip combo I wore yesterday, which is the Charlotte Tilbury Pillow Talk Intense 3 with, with Juvia's Place Libra. I also want to film uh, my favorite winter lip combos video, but I'm not gonna do it until I get my lip waxed. <laughs> All right, still got 10 minutes. Oh my gosh, the video did it. It uploaded. Yes. So update on the audiobook, The Other Black Girl. Y'all think I'm on chapter 11 now? I was on seven when I started last night and I couldn't fall asleep. I was listening to it till like one o'clock in the morning. I'm on chapter 11. Is getting good. It's making me so excited to watch the show. I just want to see how they portray everything. My favorite part. That's why I like reading the books first to see how the movie interprets it. I've said this before but I think the best adaptation from a book to a movie that I've seen is Gone Girl. That was pretty accurate. Of course they missed a few pieces but I mean that's as close as it's gonna get. Oh and Girl on the Train too. Oh you know what I have another one. Daisy Jones and the Six. That's a show. I think it's on Amazon Prime. So good. I watched it twice. How much time? Five minutes. See what a difference quick 10 minute makeup can make? Like, well that was more like 15 minutes, but that's also because I was talking. This is like my very quick makeup. When I just wanna look put together, if I'm not talking and running my mouth, I can get this done in 10 minutes. I just love feeling put together. I should do this more often. You know, not every day. I need to start taking time to do my makeup especially like on the weekends when I'm even when I'm just at home like not doing nothing just feeling put together makes such a difference in your mood like y'all when I first got on here I wasn't feeling it <laughs> I wasn't in the best mood when I first turned on this camera but now that I look cute I feel great wonderful y'all see this day three hair y'all see this this is the day look at her in all her glory the definition is still going strong I'm probably gonna get I might get five days out of this out of this twist out which is great We'll see how much I sweat in Pilates tonight. That might change the whole situation. This is the look for today. I have to hop on this call. I'll most likely pick y'all back up when I'm done with work. So I'll see y'all in a bit. I gotta go. All right, so I'm done with work. I'm getting ready to go to Pilates. I just put this sweatband on to kind of just push my hair back. Yo, I feel so bloated, like, yo. But whatever, we're about to go sweat it out, hopefully, in Pilates. Hopefully it's a nice, sweaty class. Like, you know, I feel sweat. I just kind of work out. Oh, sweat. We've all I sweat a little piece, just a little bit, not too much, but it was good. I feel great. So now we're gonna go to Old Time Pottery to see what they have as far as Christmas decorations go. Uh-uh. 
like I need lounge socks, but they were only $4. I mean, I kind of do though. I'm in the wrong section, so let me go around. Y'all, it's like dead in here. I almost thought they were closed. I smell some of these candles. Frosted berry. Ooh. Ooh, I like this one. How much is this? $10? Maybe. Oh my gosh, this one is huge. How big this candle is. It's like a peppermint candle. Giant. $15, not bad. Cheap in the Bath and Body Works. It smells just like a Christmas tree. Winter pine. Also, I'm just kind of taking stock. When I come back on Friday, when I have all day, I have a day off on Friday. So. like this fifteen dollars I'm gonna think about it though it's cute but is it cute for fifteen dollars I don't know I should get this for Mike like he doesn't have enough hot sauces already though <laughs> um, I do need a mug but these aren't giving so I guess that's it but I'm looking for some of those plates that are bowls but are plates but look like bowls together a quick dinner real quick i'm gonna show out the dinner in a second y'all i'm so i wasn't even thinking i put the camera in the bag with the glittery trees and now there's glitter all on the camera now i'm just using this to like try to dust off all the glitter i'm gonna be getting glitter off this camera for quite some time but let me show you my dinner here's my dinner so i use this bonza rigatoni protein pasta with the rotisserie chicken that i got from publix broccoli that's what i got from trader joe's a couple of weeks ago so it's my first time trying this it smells really good so we'll see i did wash the bowl that's a plate that's a bowl it has been washed so don't i also grabbed um cherry vanilla olipop my favorite flavor is strawberry vanilla i tried the lemon lime y'all it is so nasty hold on the tv oh lord very disgusting to me it was too sweet it was just gross so far strawberry vanilla is the only one i like i prefer poppy over olipop i just feel like poppy has more flavors that i like but I'm trying to give Olipop a chance, you know? I'm trying to look for um, Housewives of Potomac because there was a new episode out last night, so we have to watch that. That sauce is good. 
this food is not hot enough yeah i like my food to be piping hot all right let's try this olipop it's decent it's still not better than strawberry vanilla but i can drink that it's fine i'm clean i'm in my pjs so let's do some quick skincare and wrap this up a few more lashes came out like three or four more so i think that was another one so they're leaving i thought it was like 9 30 i was like oh i have a little bit of time to edit i'm gonna make a sleepy mocktail make my sleepy mocktail around 10 30 and go to sleep no it's 10 16 so girl i'm gonna go back to using the polish choice i've been having some issues with texture so hopefully this will get my texture back on track so i'm gonna take a break from my vitamin c my caudalie found that when i mix them when i use them both together i know it works for a lot of people but when i mix them together it like my skin does not like it so one or the other use a little bit of toner there's didn't i just buy a big one of these oh no you know what happened i went to marshall's to buy one and i left it in the cart like i never even pulled it out to check out i saw it when i was putting the cart back so i took it <laughs> i put it back old time pottery was not giving as far as decorations though i got a few but nothing crazy my dinner was so good i'm so full i thought i was gonna have a little space left in my stomach for like a little sweet treat you know a protein brownie with some ice cream nah and it's late so no so i give the alfredo the truffle alfredo give it a 9 out of 10 i would buy it again for sure but you know how trader joe's be it's probably it's not even there anymore all right so now we're gonna go in with the polish choice focus it like my texture is bad like over here over here like ugh. I noticed it when I did, um, when I edited my, when I went and got my lashes and I laid on the table. First of all, that angle was terrible, exposing me. I was like, oh my gosh, my texture is so bad. So we got to do something about that. So y'all, this is a, this is a typical Monday in my life. <laughs> I don't know what I'm going to do. Like as far as vlogmas stuff goes on the days that I'm working, because as you can see, I don't do much when I work on the days that I work. So we're going to have to figure something out. If not, I'm not posting if I'm doing absolutely nothing like that's what's the point of that I, I go to work and I watch tv that's it I shouldn't be drinking all this water before bed either but I'm so thirsty dang I forgot to do the snail mucin oh we'll do it after this some snail mucin don't neglect your neck Finally, moisturizer, this Coors RX all-in-one. Also a snail cream, snail moisturizer. Yeah. Ooey gooey. We're glazed, okay. <laughs> it settles down. All right, y'all, that is it for me. I'm gonna wrap this up. Happy Vlogmas, and I will see y'all tomorrow. Bye.